a platform for regional and national artists. It's a massive showcase. Celebrating the art market in Birmingham and the Midlands. It's in its second year now. Yeah, this year, maybe it's because of the space and the amount of people who are at the launch. There were 21 events and exhibitions during New Art Birmingham in 2007, which took place over 19 venues. We're putting our work up to display to the art-hungry masses. It's a big show, loads of artists from around the region as well as around the rest of the country. We've had a fantastic turnout. Absolutely round. It's a great vibe. Yeah, it's a good buzz, you know. The work was brilliant. There's some great people there. Every corner's been packed. It was a really good party. Emma Summer's work is amazing. I really like Stuart Mills. Ross Jones. They're just killer. Chappie behind me. I love his work. Laura Keel's work. Stuart Whips, he won the Hodge Prize. Chris Kane. I really liked it. Obviously my own work. It was really important for us this year to do two days of seminar activity, one of which was aimed at artists and the other was aimed at collectors. There's a perception that to collect art you need to be wealthy and that's not the case. It's not embarrassing anymore to like art mm. the way it might have been 20 years ago. It's actually trendy. The Artist Day was a way of enabling contemporary new and emerging artists to speak to arts professionals and contemporary artists currently working in the arts world. It was nice to hear it from successful artists. It wasn't a spare seat in the house. We're in the bond today for the Fuse limited edition exhibition. Limited edition works all under £300. Displaying new and up and coming artists around the West Midlands, making people aware of what they can buy. Photography, ceramics, graphic art. This guy is me and mini me. It's just the way I feel comfortable. Where in a box. You know what, Birmingham is not really just about Birmingham artists. We come from Leicester. I had some people from Italy and some really nice people from London turn up. Ariston came about as a response to New Art Birmingham. It's my first solo curated exhibition. The show incorporates artists from both the East and West Midlands that touch upon similar issues to my own practice. We're Ignite Photographers and we're exhibiting as part of New Art Birmingham. I've seen more people coming around an event like New Art Birmingham than if it's just one-off exhibitions. The for sale event is bringing the art out to the streets, pieces of artwork on estate agent boards. It gets you motivated to do new work. You probably get better at selling stuff as well. I sold some work, got some good feedback. I made some affordable prints. They've been racing out the door. I've already got a couple more customs to do. I've managed to sell some work tonight. I'm not a particularly commercial kind of um, artist, you know, so these kind of things are important. It's a really good opportunity for artists to sell their work and to meet collectors and curators. Being part of an event like New Art Birmingham has been great because of the publicity around it. TV, radio and also the local newspapers. The calibre of the marketing, everything that's been put across is really high. Convincing artists that they really can do it. You can actually make a living out of your work. To stand up and say, well, I am Rita Fletcher, I'm a fine art photographer. It rolls off the tongue there. This is the sort of thing that we want to see all the time. It needs to be an annual thing. It's just such a good buzz, it felt like Birmingham was taking itself a bit more seriously. It's amazing, there's, there's this kind of energy that I didn't actually know existed.